Comrades. Turns out all the fantasy rangers were right. Wearing a blanket as clothes will actually keep you pretty warm. But imagine my surprise when I wander outside this morning. Actually, when I wander outside later today and find that the place I live is now Skyrim. Snow. Snow, glorious, wet, cold, freezing snow. Yeah. I'm at this moment wearing a blanket. Tell you the truth, I kind of like it. See her on my back? Yeah. <sighs> Comrades, we're entering one of my favorite times of year. The long dark after Christmas. Oh, when everything is bitterly cold. You can't go outside without fear of frostbite. And the world looks like Skyrim. You know what? While we're out here, let's make the world really look like Skyrim. My gosh, it's cold. But hey. We're adventurers. The cold doesn't scare us. It's been too long since I've done this, everybody. Gone outside with my sword. Just enjoyed the cold. Put my hood back on. I mean, it's a little bit nippy. But yeah, it turns out you can wear a blanket. Blankets are actually clothes. Yeah, it's a weird looking hood, I know, but... Hmm. Yeah. It works. My head's warm. I don't care what you guys think. I may look dumb, but... Uh, I'm happy. Let us continue onward. So, let's see. New in my world today. Had a Merry Christmas. A fairly Merry, merry Christmas. Got to see the family. They brought presents. Got some new clothes. Classiest clothes I've ever owned. I mean, a shirt that is tailor-made to fit me. I may be starting a new fashion trend. You never know. I mean, I like it. I think it looks good. No, sorry, don't fall down. No. But yes. Uh, comrades, I guess as you sit through the unnecessarily dark intro, and I will see you on the other side. It's comrades. <sighs> Found this little place out in the woods. It's a little bit lower to the ground. I mean, I'm down in a little gully between these two hills. Yeah, the wind's not blowing so hard. Just take a moment to sit. <sighs> the holidays are over. We all knew they would be. Come on, don't look at me like that. So now all we have to look forward to is... New Year's, and where I come from, New Year's means explosions. And Valentine's Day, but come on. I don't have a Valentine. Nah. Who needs them? And I'm an adventurer. Last thing I need is some woman holding me back. Well, yeah. 
Look how gray and overcast the sky is. It's beautiful. Just so bleak, so hostile, so savagely beautiful. But yeah. <sighs> Let's we'll venture forth, shall we? I smell adventure down this way. Take my swords. Yeah, leave that. Big wet spot. Yes. It's getting kind of dusky. I mean, the best time to be outside in the cold, in the snow, well armed. Ah. So, New Year's. Let's see. What plans do I have? Not really very many. There's some people wanting me to go to some parties and I'm thinking I'll probably film that if I went. Hmm. See, tomorrow I'm supposed to go to brew house. I mean they asked me specifically to come on Thursday and I don't know why. But heck it's brew house, you know I'll go. Um That gum is pretty out here. Savagely beautiful. Good gum, I need to wear blankets more often. This is warm. Not to mention, I look pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Oh, come on. Sit down, camera. Don't drop the comrades. There you go. Comrades, I can't really see myself. How do I look? I mean, I'm not really going to try this out in front of a mirror, but I thought I'd get you guys' opinion. I mean, I for one like it. Wear it on your back like a cape. Wear it down front like a poncho. I a black one. I'd be invisible at night, wouldn't I? <sighs> yeah. The fish is warm. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. I need this and a kilt. That would be awesome. Speaking of kilts, I got to see Brave. Finally! Story about the little girl, the little Scottish girl, who, and I'm sure you guys have probably seen it, so I won't, I don't really think I'm gonna be giving any spoilers, who winds up turning her mother into a bear, and in some roundabout way, through all of that happening, they learn the true meaning of love or mother daughterhood or something like that. Anyway, I loved it. It was awesome. I loved her dad. He sounded a lot like John Cleese, but I don't think that's who did him. <sighs> the savage beauty of this place. But yes, and I decided, well not so much decided, but I'm thinking pretty heavily about it. After seeing that movie, I am going to Scotland, and I'm marrying a Scottish girl. <laughs> I love that accent, it's so pretty, it's so cute. I don't know. Fortunately, I've got a nice warm fire to get back to when I decide I'm tired of trekking around out here. Listen to the wind. Do you hear that? The moving in the trees. The dark on the trail. Something on my screen. The tree just fell. Off that way. Oh, the wind. Can you even hear me? Oh, and it's cold. Oh, is it cold? Comrades, I mean, I can take the cold. I love the cold, but with that tree falling, I think it might be time to move on. <sighs> Wind whipping my cluck around. I feel so epic right now. Through the woods. Sword out front. <laughs> Everyone, this is what it looks like to be me. So we're out front. This is first person Jake. First person chaotic disturbing. So I'm right, the winds died down a little bit here. Well, it's not so much died down, it's that ugh, little warmer spot. Dadgum, I'm so used to the aspect on my phone. I mean, I'm not used to using my camcorder anymore. I have to hold the camera way out here so that I'm not like this. But, 
a little nippy out here. A little bit, but not too bad. I can hear the slate starting to fall again. I love this time of year. Separates the men from the boys. Yeah. Huh. Just some magic feel about the place when I'm out here. I mean, the snow on the ground, the dark in the trees, the overcast sky, the sun's starting to go down. I don't know, just some magic to it. And don't ask me to explain it, because unless you're here, I doubt you could experience it. Or more or less witness it, not so much experience it. <sighs> well, comrades, I think this is going to be all for this video. I think I may have ran a little bit longer than I should have. You may not even be able to hear me, what with the wind. But, yeah, no. Thanks for watching, comrades. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. I know I did, and I will see you next time. Hopefully next time we'll be... Hmm. We should be in the city. I'm planning on going on that little trip over the river. But beneath the bridge, when I told you all about, there's this catwalk that runs beneath it. It's not it's not locked or anything. It's just a little bit difficult to get to. And but you know, stealthy me will be able to do it. Adios comrades. See you later.